everyone welcome back to the channel my name is Brownie and I'm one half of the Indecisive Readers. Today I'm here to unbox the Illumicrate Death and Fortune November box. I'm so excited for this box. Um, I can't really remember what the items and the fandoms are um, but the book is one I have actually read already but it's going to be one of my top books for the year. It really kind of surprised me. I always thought I was going to like it but I ended up really really enjoying it kind of flying through the end so yeah i'm really excited to have a special edition once i get it out so i'm going to unbox the rest of the stuff see what else is in here and then i'm probably going to cry about the book so the first item i have picked up is this tin it's like a metal tin so there's a horse on a kind of watery background and then it's got the spine and then a horse going through some water on the back um and then do you open it yes and you open it and on the inside it says there are moments that you'll remember for the rest of your life and there are moments that you think you'll remember for the rest of your life and it's not often they turn out to be the same moment and that is a quote from the scorpio races um and it's moments you remember booked in and it's designed by jez hawk very cool very handy would definitely probably use that then the next item is this fabric dust jacket and it is smells hoard fabric book jacket uh, designed by pal hammy and it says it's the perfect for every book dragon who wants to protect their books whilst reading and um, so that's really cool obviously it's got the dragon and some treasure i really really like that i have a couple of the illumicrate uh, book jackets no maybe i've only got one i think i've only got one and it's really really handy because you can use it on like hardbacks or paperbacks depending on what size you've got and then you kind of slot your book in there and then it can do up like that I think they're really handy because obviously then they can stay protected even whilst you're reading them and I really like using them so I'm glad to have another one. I'm trying desperately to ignore my cat who maybe I should rename Smile because she's a grump. Then there's a really cool little Christmas ornament. Um, it's got like green foresty design and then like tea and saucers and it says the first time you share tea you are a stranger. The second time you share tea you are an honoured guest the third time you share tea you become family and i think that's really cute obviously you can hang it on the christmas tree or something or just around and um, it says you share tea hang an ornament and it's designed by rena illustrations and it says it's a perfect as a festive decoration to hang on door or drawer handles so i'm really glad to have something like that and um, like i said find somewhere in here that i can hang that but i think that's nice because it's not too bulky and stuff and it's just a general cute thing doesn't necessarily need to be Christmassy and also doesn't necessarily need to be bookish. Then we have this metal bookmark with like a red tassel. Um, it's gold foily and it is inspired by She Who Became the Sun and it says it is designed by Delan Daniel and it features Zoo from She Who Became the Sun. So that is a book I've read and I really enjoyed it when I read it um but the other week i kept thinking about it so i bumped up to a five star rating it was oh, it was so well done um but i'm not here to um, talk about how good that book is i'm here to talk about how like really nice and shiny that is would definitely approve would definitely use having ideas for pictures with it already then the final item comes in this box with that box so it's got person then it's got like some designs um, it is obviously the next book in the Greek mythology teacup collection. And this is Nemesis, who is the god of retribution. It said it, it is designed by Niall Grant. And it says, our second Greek mythology inspired teacup features Nemesis. Nemesis was against undeserved good fortune and is the perfect deity for our death and fortune box. So what I really like about this is it's in the same kind of colour scheme as the spoiler card, as well as the book. Um, because that's what the uh, saucer it's like blue and red and black um and then this is the teacup so we'll start there um what is that person with wings um holding a sword uh, lots of wings maybe she was a winged goddess um then she's there in the middle and the design's kind of repeated all the way around once again just a very cute kind of design um it'd be really cool once they're all like together and you've got a whole collection of them I'm definitely looking forward to when that happens and then the bit i'm really looking forward to like i said is the book because <gasps> pen there's a free pen oh my god is it meant to come with a free pen it's got a yellow pen that says illumicrate that was upside down but it still says it that's really cool am i meant to get a pen 
who knows but i'm gonna like it anyway so the book of the month is this it's little thieves by margaret owen um i think it's slightly more foiled than usual i don't think it's usually that shiny but i'll go and get my uh, normal edition of it and we'll go and compare it in a minute but the sprayed edges are so cool that's really really cool so they're burgundy on top and the bottom but they've got this design down the edges which is beautiful and um, more foil in on the back this is so cool oh my god oh my god then underneath oh <laughs> then underneath the dust jacket um there's like no design on the actual like thing but that's fine because this is what it looks like underneath so it's got um a guy who i know is and a girl up there so that's going to be the main character um and then there's like someone who's searching for her so that's underneath and that's like on the actual hardcover and it's got the same like title and then on the back it's got all the other main characters oh my god that's so cool so it's got all the other main characters on the back i love that so much that's such a cool detail and i bet i might be wrong but I bet they're designed by um, the author because I know there are lots of, uh, let me find, lots of illustrations throughout the actual book and they're done by the author. So like this, there's like obviously seven tales and each time there's a new tale, it's like a fairy tale and then the following like chapters kind of relate to the fairy tale that tells and there's a picture that goes with it. It doesn't say anything on the spoiler card about them like been designed by the authors but I wouldn't be surprised if it was. So I'm just going to read to you what the book is about. Once upon a time there was a horrible girl. Vanya Smith knows that no gift is freely given, not even a mother's love. The adopted goddaughter of death and fortune, Vanya has long made her own way in the world as the dutiful servant of Princess Giselle. Until a year ago when her otherworldly mothers demanded payment for their care and Vanya decided to steal her future back by stealing Giselle's life. With the help of an enchanted string of pearls, Vanya transformed into her former mistress and took her place, leaving the real Giselle a penniless nobody. Now Vanya leads a lonely but lucrative double life as a princess and jewel thief, charming the nobility while emptying their coffers to fund her great escape. Until, one heist away from her freedom, Vanya crosses the wrong god and is cursed to turn into jewels stone by stone. With a feral guardian half-god, Giselle's sinister fiancé and an over-eager junior detective on her tail, Vanya has just two weeks to pull off her biggest grift yet. Or she risks losing more than her freedom, she could lose her life. So this is a retelling of The Goose Girl, which is obviously a fairy tale. It also has a demisexual main character, and love interest and there's also a female female side romance it's just it's so good i really like the romance he had just hit a point where sam was like do you want to do something tonight and i'm like nope i'm gonna read and it was such a nice feeling to be like all i want to do right now is just read so so good um i'm just also going to show you the um pin oh where are we i'm going to show you the pin that comes with it and then here is the uh, what's called artwork i think that's one of the pages um so that's really cool um it's got the death and fortune where are they death and fortune who are the godparents and then vanya as a young child and her mum so that's really cool i'm gonna go and get my like original copy just to show you the comparison so this is what the two look like side by side like i said i don't think a lot about the actual cover has changed it's possibly got a bit darker it's like black rather than blue um but mostly it's the foil in which is really really cool so yeah i really enjoyed this unboxing i'm so pleased with the book i'm so pleased with the items actually i'm really impressed by them all um and yeah let me know if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did comment down below to let me know if you've read it or if you like any of the items subscribe if you're not already and i'll see you in another video